Now that I have shown you uh, the Anand Chaitya where the Buddha prepares his uh, disciples for life after his Mahaparinirvana, where they realize that they have lost their jewel. That is what Motihari means, the town called Motihari. Anyway, the next stop is in the Mahaparinirvana story, he tells Anand, let us go to the country of Pava, that is Parsa village. Parsa has been mispronounced as Pava. Anyway, the Buddha goes and it is around 28 kilometers southwest from Motihari. Pa Parsa village, which is mispronounced as Pava. And over there, what do you call it? Uh, previously, the Buddha had, uh, what do you call it? Uh, 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 inaugurated a preaching hall which the Buddhists called a Mote Hall. Folks, Mote Hall is a mispronunciation of the Indian word Mutt. Mutt. And thank you Buddhists. Thank you very much because you have given me the meaning of Mutt. See, a lot of villages have Mutts. Now it turns out that it is a preaching, those were the, the mats are the preaching halls. So basically, the Buddhist story, see, Buddhist story, it explains a lot of missing links. So, what do you call it? Uh, this, uh, the Buddha, uh, he uh, inaugurates a preaching hall. You know what the preaching hall's name is, folks? Do you know what the preaching hall's name is? It is mispronounced in the Buddhist text as Ubbhataka. Ubbhataka. The preaching hall's name is Patkhauli. It is a small village today. Patkhauli. Patkhauli means to open a temple's door. Patkhauli means to open a uh, what do you call it? Uh, holy places door. But Khauli means to inaugurate a preaching hall. To opening a door. See, when uh, uh, people go to pray to a Hindu temple, they wait for the Pat Khauli. Pat Khauli is when the Brahman priest opens the door. So that means it's uh, sort of Pat Khauli is the inauguration. So that is the uh, Mote Hall, that is the preaching hall. It's actually a mutt that the Buddha inaugurated, folks. Don't forget to visit it. Don't forget to visit it. Because uh, Sariputra, he, uh, he, what do you call it? It is very nicely described where the Buddha sat where Sariputra sat, where the Sangha sat. And Sariputra, I think he uh, said uh, he some uh, sutra, I forget the name. Uh, I forget the name. So basically, folks, check out. Uh, I hope you found this video, video educative. If you did so, don't forget to follow, like and subscribe to my page Buddha Exhumed and don't forget to tell your friends and relatives about my page. Thank you.